things needed mobile charger 1 inch pvc pipe 2 inch in length and 3 inch in length 1 inch pvc elbow 1 inch pvc cap 2 dc motor on off switch electric wire super glue and gum drill bit and hydro bottle cap Make a hole on the cap and pass the charger wire through it. Now pass it through 2 inch length PVC pipe. Now pass it through the elbow. Now press all the 3 connectors so that they are connected well. Now make a hole on other cap as well. Now cut a small portion so that the switch can be fitted on the 3 inch length PVC pipe. Now connect a small piece of electrical wire to one side of the switch and solder it. Now take the phone charger wire and connect it to other side of the switch. This helps in switching on and off the motor. Connect the wire coming from the switch to the motor. Now connect the other end of the charger wire to the motor. Now connect to the power and check if motor is running or not. There is a small gap between the motor and the PVC pipe. So I am just adding some plastic to cover the space. Apply some glue so that uh, PVC pipe and the motor are correctly connected. Now put the cap on the top and press bit hard so that all the joints are correctly connected. No need to use any glue to connect the joints. Now check if the motor is working fine and also if switch is working correctly. Now let's connect the drill bit to the motor. I am using a small connector to connect this. Apply some super glue so that the drill bit does not come out. Let's test this now.
elbow shape of this drilling machine gives extra grip while drilling. You can also connect the drill bit to the motor using this electrical wire connector. For safety purpose, we can put this cap in the front. We need to slightly remove the front portion. Now secure it with super glue. Now drilling machine is ready to use.
Thank you.